And welcome back to another WWF No Mercy Championship Mode playthrough. It's a continental title with Duke Nukem. Let's continue on to Chapter 5 here. What is Chapter 5 called? Champion's Trap. Hey, it's the APA. You guys will do anything for money, right? As will I. Almost anything, I should say. I will pay you to beat up Duke. Oh, man. Give us some money and we'll think about it. How about I pay after I see what kind of work you can do? We will show you right now if you don't give us your money. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll pay you. Just do the job. I don't think... Count their money and smile. Ratchon Farouk. Okay, we'll do it. You want Duke to get beat up, right? No problem. I don't want him to remember his mother. Beat him good. <laughs> oh, the dialogue in this game. Hilarious. Uh, God damn it. Handicap match. You know, I avoided this fight in the uh, hardcore match or the hardcore championship playthrough. And I guess I can't avoid it now. I knew one day, one time or another I'd have to face the APA. Hey, it's Bradshaw. Where's Farouk, you might ask? Well, they don't have tag team intros in this game. So Farouk gets his own intro. That's right, Acolytes Protection Agency. That's right, here comes Farouk. Yeah! Farouk. Damn, Ron Simmons, my friend. Yeah, we've already seen my entrance a couple hundred times already. Let's go! Oh dear God. I was thinking about losing this match on purpose. But, but so far as I've said, I've been undefeated during these playthroughs that I can remember. So I'm going to beat the hell out of both these guys. Hopefully. Or just beat the hell out of one. As the other one tries his damnedest to hurt me. I got the hiccups at the moment, so excuse me. Why couldn't I reverse that, huh? I reversed his power bomb. Look out! Oh dear. If I get beat naturally, well then, I'm sorry. I failed you all. As a gamer, as a wrestling fan, and as a, as a friend. Tell my family if I do lose this match that I love them very much. And tell the girl that I'm madly in love with, who won't return my love, that I love her. And if she returns my love, tell her it's too late for me. If she doesn't return my love, well, she can go fuck herself. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. There you go, look out. Come here, Farouk. Stop running and let me beat your ass. Oh, dear God, don't beat my ass. I'm Duke Nukem. I know nothing about Duke Nukem's games. I'm going to be honest with you. I just think he's a cool character because I've heard of his voice clips. And he has a really funny looking design to me. Very simple, you know. Jeans, tank top, sunglasses, got Guile's hair, Street Fighter, and he has a really rocking theme song that, I think it's a uh, grab bag, I think it's called, that's the Duke Nukem one I know. In fact, I might actually play it during one of these playthroughs, maybe for the credits, or maybe at the end. When I'm facing the champ, dear God, they're beating the hell out of me. If I face Chris Benoit, I might play it as my entrance music. Oh, he's flexing, Farouk. I'm on danger, man. I'm not even going to remember who my mother is. Oh, God. Can I beat them? Yes, I can. Will I beat them? I don't know. I got to spam the hell out of this move, so it seems to be doing me well. Damn it, Farouk. I keep forgetting. It's a two-on-one handicap match. It's not just a simple one-on-one -on -one beat the hell out of Bradshaw while Farouk watches. Like so! Ha-ha! You want some of me? Huh? Come and get it. My face. Drop kicked. But hey, at least I got the aggression meter right now. Oh dear God, this isn't going to end well. I can't feel my back. Can't feel my face. Can't feel my legs. 
Neither can... Oh, I was about to say, neither can Bradshaw. Where are you going there, buddy? Ah! <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh! What the hell? I've never seen that reversal before in this game. That was weird. I have never seen that reversal. First time for everything, you know? This kick is doing me wonders. It's gaining me a lot of momentum. And it has a bunch of invincibility frames. Oh dear, what's going on? Oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> well, if you wanted to see me get my ass kicked, there you go. Nothing more, nothing less. Aha! Don't call it a comeback because I never left. That's right. What you got? Oh, he's eliminated. Stop clapping, you bitch. Get back in this ring so I may hit you. Look at my momentum. That was from getting my ass kicked. Like I said, don't call it a comeback because I never left. Da 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 I actually like how Farouk's special looks in this game, the Dominator. The animations in this game, still to this day, are awesome One, looking. Two. Damn it! It's alright, it's alright. For I am Duke Nukem, and I am forever. Give me that fucking arm. Sorry for swearing. That's right, Farouk, you just watch. Just watch as I break your friend's arm. Man, Bradshaw, JBL nowadays. You used to be a good commentator. Now you're just stupid. I'm sorry. Unless they make you act that way. Uh, lights are on bright, Michael. Lights are on. This ball game, you know. Kind of don't like JBL anymore. I used to like him. I kind of don't. It's funny. People hate Michael Cole, but... The thing is, he's actually the, uh, the strongest commentator right now. Well... Not counting MR. Oh, MR is actually my favorite commentator right now. But then again, MR has said some stupid stuff. But then again, you gotta remember, nowadays it's for children, so they gotta make the kids laugh. You know. Damn it! And hell, even when, uh, Camp WWE was coming on, they're like, we gotta remind you that all of our WWE programming will remain PG until further notice. A lot of people want the PG era to die. They want it to go away. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't noticed much difference. It depends on who's wrestling, it seems. Like, Cena can get away with anything because he's John freaking Cena. Undertaker can get away with anything because he's the freaking Undertaker. Triple H can get away with anything because he's Triple H. Suck on that, but... Bradshaw, I almost called him Batista. Damn it! Why won't one of you just stay down? So, oh my god! Oh god, I can't take this pain anymore through my balls, man. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I got an idea. What are you trying to do, Bradshaw? Trying to throw me out of the ring? Take that. Come on, Farouk. Show me what you got. As Bradshaw's out. That's right, Farouk. You got nothing. Jesus, that Bradshaw hammer, man. Come on, Bradshaw. Or Farouk. Doesn't matter which one I beat the hell out of, I'm gonna beat the hell out of one of ya. Farouk it is. Break his fucking arm. Sorry for... <laughs> Damn it, Bradshaw. You didn't wait very quickly to break that, huh? Or I should say you didn't wait very long. Come here! I got one of them. I gotta stop yelling into my microphone. Suck on that! Oh, that was a power bomb and a half. Why am I using the Dominator? Because it's probably stronger than my special. Not to mention, clothesline from hell, ten times quicker than mine. So I can do this. One, two, two three. three. Accolades Protection Agency. You should change your name to the Accolades. I've just got my ass whooped by Duke Nukem. Like I said, don't call to come back because I never, I never left. <laughs> Anyway, 
I hope you enjoyed this part of my WWF No Mercy Championship playthrough, the Intercontinental title with Duke Nukem. Stay tuned for some more. My name is Clinker Roth, and I thank you all so much for watching.